All right. Can you hear me now? Hello. All right. I can't get on the prize map. Hmm. Well, anyway, I was saying that the beach area is really cool. Like to see all the sand and stuff. That's really, really cool. You even got a little sand castle stuff. So I just think that's really cool. What do you guys think about this sand area? You think it's cool? Oh, there's so much you could do with this. It's crazy. Just the I mean the things they could do with this uh with the beach area. Prize map works for some people. I, I know that. That's a cool little balloon. Yeah, some people can get the prize map to work. Some people can't. Now, that's always something, you know it? Isn't it always something? It's always something. Every update, every new prize map, every little thing, big thing they do, it always, it never, it never works out for them the way they hope. I know, yeah, some people can actually look at their um, prize map. So maybe this, maybe this time we'll, oh, there you go. Maybe this is, maybe they're either going to kick me or they're going to put me in something that's going to work. We'll see. You're in drawing, man. Nice. All right. What's the game going to do? The game's either going to kick me or it's going to put me inside of the giddy park where I can look at the prize map. What's it going to be, game? What are you going to do to me? Hello, neck rose. All right, game, what are you going to do? Give it to me now. Let me know how it's going to be. Dosh Gaming is going to kick you. I'm waiting to see if it's going to kick me. Man, wouldn't it be great if they could do anything without having problems with their game it's crazy because um well i knew that was gonna happen you know i have uh it's crazy you you play you play hundreds of different games and all those games have updates never no problems it, it's amazing every other game doesn't update never a problem but this game, Garden Warfare 2 included, everything they do, and I mean everything they do, causes issues. Unbelievable. What is it going, what's going on in their studio that they cannot release anything without having issues? There's a problem. People need to be fired. People need to be hired. This is unbelievable. Yeah, fall guys tomorrow. That's going to be cool. Yeah, this game can't do anything right indeed. That, that's just unbelievable. Like... You just add a prize map and sand 
to Giddy Park and it causes trauma to your whole game. And that's that's terrible. I've got Horizon Chase Turbo. Well, any other game does an update and there's no problem. But when PopCap does an update, it causes problems. That's just incompetence. There, people need to be fired. People need to be fired. People need to be hired. This isn't the way you run a gaming company. Well, that loading screen, is that a foreshadowing of a version of the mobile game coming to Battle for Neighborville? Will one day Battle for Neighborville have a in-game version of the mobile game? Is that what that could be? Because I don't see why they would put that in the loading screen. If it was, if they put that in the loading screen just to promote the mobile game, I'm pretty sure it would have said on the screen, buy the mobile game or download the mobile game. I would think it would say that, but since it doesn't say anything about the mobile game, I'm thinking that one day we're going to have that, but in a better version, it's going to be an event or just a game mode you can play anytime you want. But one day I do think we're going to get that. Zero prize bulbs and zero coins. Wow. Hello, Professor. I couldn't hop on the game either. I'm st I, I mean, I got on the game. Then the game kicked me. Oh, my goodness. Well, you see what's happening now. Let me get on Twitter real quick. See if PopCap had the nerve. Or no, the decency. To say that we have issues as always. Please bear with us. Oh, did you guys see that? Um, uh, Spider-Man will be coming exclusively to the Avengers game on PlayStation. All right. Pop Cap has not said anything on Twitter. So, I guess they don't know, or they just don't care. I don't know. Hello, Sonic. Ah, oh, man. To accept the user agreement. Jeez. Uh, did you guys see this? Uh, the Mean Greens Plastic Warfare it comes out August fifth. It's a game where you're like the little green plastic army guys. Um, I don't know if you've seen You can see the trailer for it. Interesting. Yeah, it looks interesting. I, w I want to know how much it costs, though. The Mean Greens Plastic Warfare. I want to know how much that's going to cost. And I wish they had a demo to it. I would love to play a demo and see how it is. And then on Call of Duty, the game that just continues to get bigger and bigger, Season 5 coming tomorrow, the stadium roof opens and the train arrives in Verdansk. So that's probably going to be another 20 gig download. Uh, well, also, girls, they like to reply to females. And then if you're on PlayStation, um, check your notifications because... It's possible they'll send you 
on a little code where you could get a year of PlayStation Plus for like 26 bucks or something like that. Come on, game. It's ridiculous. You know, they got they got Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege Deluxe Edition for a little, for ten bucks. That's right, Brokenville. Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege Deluxe Deluxe Edition, which includes year one and year two operators. You can get that for ten bucks. And they said they're going to, like, there's not going to be a part two for for a long, long, long time. And they said they're going to support that game for the next 10, 15 years. Hello, Hunter. I was logged into the game, but then the game kicked me because the uh, prize map didn't work. I got a Marvel's Avenger beta pre-order starts on PS4 August 7th, but there's a open beta that will start later. I want to play that game before I order it. I just, the game looks cool. The Avengers game looks cool, but I still want to play it though. I want to play it first. Hello, Oscar. Let's go over here and check it out. Let's see if we can do it. Can we do it? Yes, we can. Hello, how about no? Alright, let's go ahead and go through these, shall we? Let's take a look at this and see what you guys think. Will you take it? Or will you not? Squashed S'mores hat. I'll take it. I'll take that hat. I'll take it. Even though I don't like s'mores, I don't like marshmallow. But I'll take that. And then 50 free prize balls. I think that we can all agree we'll take that. Let's rock. I think we all can agree we'll pass on that. And then if we go if we go this way, that's that's the longer path. That's more prize bulbs. So we're gonna go we're gonna take the pathway that's gonna save us more prize bulbs. Alright, so that's a head head lob. Alright, that's, uh, yeah, I'll, I won't be doing that. Um, bring, bringing the heat. How do you get a lot of prize bulbs? Yeah, just play the game. There's no magic secret. Oh, look at that. You got little rats. Want a water ski? Mm, the rats could look better than that. Um, what was that? Pistachio ice cream? Or mint? Maybe mint chocolate ice cream? Kind of toxic mint chocolate? Hello, Yoda. Mouse boat. So, I guess the theme of the beach is mice. Mice is the theme of the beach. Okay. Uh, yes. Oscar, it's up to the game companies. It's up to the... Most of the game companies are going to do it. But they're not going to force game companies to do it. Um, 
after I get out of this prize map, I'll show you something. I'll show you what's I'll show you what makes it easy. Alright, so let's see. If I go down to the bottom, I gotta go five and six, that's eleven. If I go up top, I gotta do fifteen, so we're gonna go down low, but let's take a look at this. Oh, that's kinda cool. That's kinda cool. Yeah, it's cool. It got a little tail. Alright, uh, I would take that. Alright, a 25 cent coin of Zomboss. Because he's a paid little liar, that's why. Guard target. Alright. Alright, Marco. And I'm sure there's going to be a Polo somewhere. Of course, Yoda Jedi. Why wouldn't I say it? Alright, hot dog and a burger. But you know what? They got ketchup on the dog and ketchup on the burger. And no, 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 no. You don't do that. Don't do that. Don't put ketchup on your hot dog. Don't put ketchup on your burger. Don't do it. Save yourself. Alright, Dave gets his own coin. How about that? Alright, well who would you rather have? Dave's coin or Zomboss's coin? Zomboss looks devious. He looks like like he pooped his pants and he's got like a, a plan. Crazy Dave just looks like he's happy. He's got a taco. Life is good. Alright, what is this? Silly Grilly. Silly Grilly. Alright, Silly Grilly. So, yeah, it looks pretty silly to me. Alright, they got, what is that, like some kind of sausage or some kind of dog. And I don't know where that meat came from. Alright, we're going to get this. Alright, of course, everybody likes that. Yeah, so far the prize map does suck so far. Alright, we'll go... We'll go this way. Alright, you burnt. You burnt. Alright, that's pretty lame. Alright, kite might. Alright, you want to fly a kite? I'm sure somebody does. Really? Timber? Timber. Timber? Okay, we're logging trees now. Alright, space bolts. Eh. It's kinda like it's kinda like a Star Wars type helmet on like a homeless engineer. That's a cute little piece of cheese. I guess that's a piece of cheese. Shelly. Like to see that little cute piece of cheese be a character. Alright, this gesture obviously took about five years to make. Wow. Wow. And there goes that polo. You knew they had to come with the polo. Shall we dance? Shall we dance? That had the whole company laughing so hard they all pooped their pants. That's how hilarious that was. Complete kite off. Alright. All the kites in the world. There you go. Making a hot air balloon out of kites. Alright, this is a tribal statue. Okay. Here's your little luminous fungus. Now, if they would have made, if they would make this glow, if he would, like, if she would glow, then that would be cool. But since she doesn't glow, it's not really cool. I don't think it's cool, because she doesn't glow. Alright, that's going to go with his outfit. So, whoa, he's got a bird. Oh, that's cool. The bird, the bird's feathers hold the uh, arrows. All right, surf, take over. All right. 
shell bean. All right, hills over there. Boomtown, another fireworks. All right. All right, the little ice cream on top is happy. The little chocolate ice cream is mad. Mad that he has to share himself with a piece of strawberry and a cherry, I guess. Big mood. Big mood? Mm, I don't know where people come up with this stuff. All right, go fish. All right, go fish. All right, that's very colorful, isn't it? Clownfish car. But there's no label on the little um, sign right there. Very colorful, though. All right, Chomp Night. All right. I guess, I don't know, I guess that's cool. He's got like an axe, a little battle axe on his helmet. I guess that could be cool. Oh, come over here. All right. Fortress Nut. All right. So it's a fortress. All right. I guess that's cool enough. Got the little acorn dressed up like a little knight. Little Cinna's Chop. This is... All right, so that's that's cool. I'd wear that. Let me go all the way down. Too bad we can't look at it, but then of course you'll get a purple one. Hello, Pozo. All right, so you want to get a lot of prize bulbs? Here you go. Here's your prize bulbs. Do these challenges. Like once you once you do all these challenges, you'll get a crap load of prize bulbs, and then every single day there's two challenges you can do. Every single day there are two time challenges. So let's think about this. Let's say there's 30 days, 30 days in a month, right? And you get two prize bulbs per day, right? That's an easy 60. That's 60 prize bulbs. Just from doing just from doing that. Add to it the fact that you're actually playing the game. And that's more. Let's see. Who should we do? Who should I do first? Pea Shooter, Citron, Scientist, 80s Action Hero. Hmm, I don't know which one I'll do. But look at that hat. Shrimp, Shrimp and Imp. Shrimp and imp. 80s? Dang, everybody likes the 80s, huh? You guys are 80s action hero fanatics. Alright, earn experience. Land hits with can't missile. Vanquish multiple enemies in one rocket ride. Deal dynamite dodge damage. Land hits with the bow last. I don't... So now with private play, you can do that on private play. Um, usually what I do, though, is um, I'll go to... If, if it's a zombie, I'll go to Mount Steep. <laughs> But this beach is really cool, though. Got a little turtle here. Did you kill the turtle? Nope, no killing the turtle. Got a little octopus. Got a little half-eaten fish. How nice is that? Beach chairs, which nobody can fit in except the imp. There's that little shark. I wish that shark was a character. He'd be cool. Oh, look at this one. 
Now that's a fancy little sandcastle right there. I'm sure the pirate approves. <clears throat> so that's really cool. Oh, look at this. We got... Uh, the plants don't have this, do they? We could perform a little show over here. Oh, too bad I knocked it down. Little imps. We can get little imps to do this. You know what we gotta do? We gotta get a bunch of imps to do a performance. We have to. We have to get some imps to get behind the keyboard, microphones, and do a performance and put it on video. That'd be funny. Oh, that's pretty cool. I think the zombies... I think it's safe to say that the zombies backyard... I mean, the zombies area is better than the plants. That's what it's looking like. You hope they don't sell the costume for, with rucks? Well, anything to make money, they'll, they'll be willing to do it. All right. Let's see. What do you get here? You get that, that, and that. And that little gesture. Hmm. I can't. But that's funny. <clears throat> that's actually a good one. I can't believe they did that, though. Can't believe they had a, had him stick a firework between his butt cheeks. Hello, T Bone Gaming. You said look up. Oh, the sandcastle. Man, I, li I like that. That's cool. Um, the plants. Um, the plants. Like, I like. I seen the one over here. I mean, for the plant side, that is. Wait, there's more now. When I first logged into the game, there was only one. But yeah, this is really cool, though. They did. A, they did a really good job. Really good job with this, especially the plants, the uh, zombie side. Hello, Justin Thorne. I see the plants. See, <clears throat> the plants don't have any, like, they don't have that. You know, there's a. Uh... I don't know. They don't have nowhere. That they, they don't have no performance area where they can sing. I don't know. Maybe the plants don't like to sing. Who knows? But yeah, this is cool, though. Um, man, dude, the possibilities you could have on this. You could play some beach volleyball. <clears throat> All kind of stuff. Yeah, this just might be the best Giddy Park decoration thing they've done yet. I think, I think that could be the case. Yeah, the stage is cool. We got to get little imps to do it, though. You got to get little imps to do it. I destroyed the whole thing, though. But see, so you get little imps to do it. And then they do a little performance. They start singing. I'm telling you, we gotta get a bunch of little imps and do a performance. We have to. Hello, Miles. Alright, so let me go back to this prize map real quick. I forgot to tell you. So, obviously, I would take that purple acorn, I'll take the s'mores hat. I'll take the rainbow stars. And, um, let's see. I'll take that tiger hat. I'll take the two coins. 
And of course, I'll take the rainbow stars. Um, I'll take that engineer hat, I guess. And mm, I'll take the ice cream. I'll take that clownfish up there. I'll take that chomper outfit, and then I'll take this. And um, yeah, that's it. <laughs> All right, so anyway, um, you know with these challenges that you have to do, what I, what I would what I do is I go to like if it's a zombie, I go to the um, Weirding Woods, and then I start up a boss battle. And when you got a boss battle coming, you guys know what a boss battle is when you go to Town Center, Mount Steep, and Weirding Woods. You just easily do all your little quests. Um, but now you got private play, so you can even do some things on private play. But yeah, this all this stuff is not hard at all to do. Earn experience, land hits, vanquish multiple enemies, deal dynamite. Nah, that's all nothing special. Alright, and then tomorrow... We will get our new event, which should be exciting. Should be. Tomorrow, we should be able to play as the Wildflower and the TV Head Zombie. That should be happening tomorrow. So, matter of fact, 22 hours and 33 minutes. Now, of course, I'm sure there's going to be login issues. And I'm sure it's going to mess up the game. And all that nice stuff so who knows when it's gonna go live but hopefully they can do it but yeah it's gonna be cool tomorrow though that should happen yeah say no to login issues I think this is the best sandcastle that they've made I think I think this is the best sandcastle. Oh, they even got his parrot with them. How nice is that? They even got his parrot with them. Now that's detail right there. Can't forget the parrot. Very nice. Very, very, very nice. How'd you get scammed, Miles? How did you get scammed? Who scammed you? What did they do to you? And how did they do it? Alright. Oh, here goes. Oh, this is another one little... Little thing. Alright. Uh, Multi-plate. What could you even play? I don't know. All right, Jam Squad, there you go. That's the prize map. That's this little giddy part. And I'm just going to go ahead and do this little guy's little quest real quick. Get that done. And I'll stream some, you know what? I'll stream some Garden of Warfare 2 tonight. Yeah, Daryl Nichols, the coins are cool. So... Alright, I'll be playing, I'll be streaming some Garden Warfare 2 tonight, so I'll catch you guys then. But, you know what time it is. It's time to jam out. Alright, get on those prizes.